NASA plans to launch a suborbital spacecraft during the eclipse tomorrow to measure atmospheric changes as the moon passes between the Earth and the sun. Earlier today, Cave, you spoke with an expert from NASA to learn more about tomorrow's research. We are very used to the normal interactions. The sun rises, the sun sets, heats the atmosphere, normal occurrences happen. Imagine now you block the sun or you block portions of the sun and so you're heating um, you know, the area right above Austin or right above the path of totality in a different way. Now, where we are in Washington, D.C. or someone else in South America will look up at the sun and not notice any difference. And so the atmosphere is being interacted with by the sun in a sort of unusual way. And so understanding how atmosphere dynamics work during these eclipses can tell us about dynamics in the atmosphere when eclipses aren't happening. You, of course, will need special eye protection if you hope to see tomorrow's eclipse. You can watch a tutorial on how to make solar glasses and listen to KVU's full interview with NASA on KVU's YouTube channel.